I feel like sometimes I think for women who don't work outside the home or have a huge passion project going on, they're like, wait, I don't, I, what do I do now? And I think that's who a lot of these listeners are in my podcast, because that was me for 17 years. I've been a stay-at-home mom all this time. And when I turned 45, I was like, I have the midlife itchies. Like well, when I left Bobby Brown Cosmetics and SD Lauder, I was 59 without a plan. And it was really the weirdest thing was I, I'm so used to being busy. All of a sudden it went from a hundred to zero. For women who are thinking like, okay, what's next for me? Mm -hmm. what, what's your advice for them? Well, start to think about what you want and what you like, you know, either something will fall in your lap. You know, I think of my friends, my sister-in-law, you know, one of my, my two sister-in-laws, one of them was a teacher and she, you know, retired and she traveled with her husband a bit and then she needed something. She didn't want another job, but now she volunteers and like literally feeds families that, you know, are, are really in need, like in her community and she gets to know the kids and she gets to read to the kids and she's very fulfilled. You know, my other sister-in-law who was a, another, who also was a teacher, I think she was a vice principal when she retired, she got a job in a fancy linen store. She just loves dressing up a couple days a week and selling really nice sheets and linens and she gets, you know, a lot of them for free. So she, like, she loves it, that makes her happy. And she spends time with her husband and, you know, reinvents her life. A lot of women at this age are like, I can't start something new. I don't know what I'm doing. It's not gonna be perfect. Like, what are your thoughts on kind of figuring it out, learning on the go? Well, first of all, don't ever say can't. And tread slowly, you know, tread slowly. And I think that, you know, and just do it. Like, let's just say you don't know what you wanna do, but you know you want your own business. Like, what is what do you have? that you can offer people to so make the best granola. Are you, can you clean and organize? Can you drive someone's kids? Like, you know, could you make sauces and jars? Like what is your superpower? So it's your like script to write.